Welcome, this is my polyphonic video blog number 15. And this video blog, I wanted to talk about whether or not it's a good idea to have multiple jobs while doing your student work. Now, it's one of those things where, as a student, they're always telling you that you need to focus on, you know, well, you just need to be in school and you need to study and you need to do this. Now, the only kicker is, um, sometimes you need to work to pay rent. If your scholarship doesn't necessarily cover everything, you're going to have to find ways to make, you know, your money happen. So, one of the things that a lot of people I've found tend to turn down is federal work study. Now, federal work study, is actually what I'm doing right now, uh, is a program which is absolutely fantastic. And so many people get it in their first semester and then never use it after, you know, they just, oh sweet, I just got three grand. But the problem is with, with federal work studies, if you don't use it, it goes away. So there are numerous jobs on campus, on various campuses that only will hire if you have federal work study. And if you burn that in your first, uh, first year there, you're in trouble. Because it's once you once you don't get it, it becomes much much harder to ever get it again. So what I'm doing right now is I have a federal work study job. You want to pick federal work study jobs that are that are going to kind of maybe not necessarily be exactly in the field that you're doing. Obviously, I'm not practicing my horn right now. I'm actually in the mailroom doing some sorting for the dean's office job, which is what I work for. Now, the reason why I like working in the dean's office is it gives you a real kind of, you start to get an understanding of, first of all, how, all the people involved that it takes to run a music school, and also the, you get an understanding of how a music school works. So there are numerous kind of jobs where you can do uh, departmental uh, coordinator jobs, you can do jobs where you might be doing it in an administrative role, but there's a lot of employment opportunities in administration. So it's something that you want to keep your eyes open. And the reason why federal work study is so crucial is because the way it, it allows the universities to hire in a much, much uh, lower cost to the departments themselves. The government subsidizes your weekly salary. However, one of the drawbacks of federal work study, some jobs don't necessarily have the funding to keep you on after you've completed your work study. So as a result, let's say you've got a $3,000 work study and you earn $3,000 over the course of a semester. As soon as it's out, the department then has to start paying 100% of your wages and sometimes they don't have that money. So you need to be careful with your jobs and make sure that, you know, it can't be a primary source of income, but it can be a nice supplemental source of income to cover, you know, phone bills, to cover kind of incidental costs, and um, usually they come with a little bit more flexibility than a typical waitressing job or waiter job where you have to be there, you're not a choice. Work study jobs, they understand that school comes first. So that's one thing you want to keep in mind when you're looking around and Particularly if you're a freshman and you're like, oh sweet, federal work study, that's 3000 bucks I get. If you don't use it, they'll take it away the next year. Um, in my undergrad, I used actually well beyond it. And there are a couple departments usually that have federal work study, but they've got a budget to keep you on afterwards. And those are usually departments like operations that have to physically have people there. They can't just suddenly stop having you. Another one is uh, usually food services. And that's something that... You know, in undergrad I had the choice, well, I could get a, a waiting job and I work my weekends uh, waiting tables, but the problem is, is if I get a gig, they're usually on the weekends, and it's usually going to be on an evening in the weekends, and there's only so many times you can tell your, your, uh, <laughs> you can tell your supervisor at, you know, wherever you're working, oh, I'm not going to come this week. The nice thing about federal work study is that it's kind of built into the <laughs> particular uh, how to say it in the particular, uh, uh, I guess, the mentality, because they know that you're there to study first and foremost. So, anyway, mail sorted, time to get back to work.